At this point, I'm pretty sure all you guys know that this channel is gonna be full of spoilers. You've been warned. <laughs> Miraculous Ladybug was originally gonna be a darker series for the audience aimed at teenagers, but now it's a lighter series for family and kids to enjoy. Literally anyone can watch it now. Back in the old days where Ladybug was new and fresh, there's a lot of concept that had to be thrown away. Unfortunately, Felix was thrown away along too. Felix was the first shot noir before Adrian. He was a much more darker character, and Hug Daddy had to throw away Felix because he wasn't good enough for long-term plot development. I mean, I agree with that too. Felix was a total thundersade, or anime cliche as they say. First, he's mean and cold towards everyone, but then slowly he starts opening up. But after a long time of being rude, you just suddenly became nice? What? That makes no sense. As William Shakespeare said, or someone who's famous at writing, I don't know. Sometimes you're gonna have to sacrifice characters for the sake of the story. On the bright side, Hawk Daddy has been reconsidering on bringing back Felix's character. But nothing has been set in stone. Yet. I was exploring Tumblr and I came across this awesome blog that basically lists and summarizes all the reasons of why Felix is not exactly a good character. I'll leave a link down below in the description box or you can click on the box right there if you're interested to read all the information. 100% credit belongs to the rambling of an Arden nerd, but seriously, Felix is more of an anti-hero instead of a sidekick slash hero slash companion if you ask me. Felix was just using Ladybug, trying to be nice, being flirty with her just so she could like him back and kiss him so he could finally remove this ring that has bad luck with it. I was surprised about this, and there's actually a whole bunch of evidence to back this up. He only saw Ladybug as a way out of his bad luck and curse. And that means the whole entire time he was being nice to her just so she will like him back. But I'm pretty sure these two will eventually learn about each other and slowly fall in love and fall in love for their true selves on the inside. Why do I know this? Because this always happens in animes and series where the happy-go-lucky main female character falls in love with the cold, mean guy who eventually warms up to her. And then, probably near the end of the series, Felix finally realizes his true feelings for Marinette slash Ladybug and they both fall in love and live happily ever after. <laughs> Too bad we'll never find out. But, at least we got a cute little boy named Adrian. I like Adrian personally, cause he's sweet, nice towards everyone. Even to the meanest girl in France. Cough, cough, Chloe. And he's a little shy, which is understandable. How can someone hate this precious sim and roll? I'm not saying we have to forget about Felix, and I hope I didn't offend any of you who are Felix lovers. I don't mind, you can love whatever you want, but it, I think it's time we have to Elsa. We can't force Thomas to put Felix on the show, as in, that's what I mean. You just gotta respect his wishes to stop mentioning Felix. The past is the past, guys. We only got the future and the present. To be honest, I like hot anime guys like Felix. But I'm gonna miss him, you're gonna miss him. But if we have high hopes, maybe Felix can return. Felix's character has great potential if they could put it in the right direction. But until then, make sure you subscribe and like so I know if you want more videos. And see you next time. And remember... Spread the love with Ladybugs.